190 passengers on board, all safe tonight, but what a ride. Atlanta News First, Joshua Skinner is live tonight at Hartsfield Jackson Atlanta International Airport. Josh, new sound paints a scary picture. Yeah, absolutely, Carly. When most people fly on a plane, you know, people tend to worry about what happens when you're in the air, but really the most harrowing part of any flight is the takeoff and landing. So listen to this audio between the Atlanta flight tower and flight 1437 in the moments after its landing gear caught fire. Delta flight 1437 from Richmond to Atlanta touched down on time. That was when things went wrong. It sounds like we blew a tire for 1437, is that correct? Yes, sir, we did see uh, smoke and fire coming off of uh, one of your tires. After a couple of minutes, the plane's landing gear was still ablaze. The 1437, the flames on the right uh, main gear are on fire and visible from the tower. Would you like to enact any emergency procedures at this time? The captain made the decision to evacuate all 190 passengers. Tower, I just wanted to verify the emergency equipment is on the way. Are we still on fire? Yes, sir. Uh, the emergency equipment is on the way as far as we can see. Emergency crews then rushed to the scene and moved passengers to safety. Go ahead and start rounding up everybody so we can get a count and hold everybody to the grassy area. All units hold everybody to the grassy area. Now all of this took place over the span of just about 15 minutes from the time the plane touched down to the time where rescue crews were making sure everybody was safe in that grassy area. We do know that uh, there is one person who is reported injured in all of this. We do not know the status of that person, but we will be sure to let you know when we find out more about them. But again, 190 passengers, everyone is safe, one reported injury. We do not know exactly why that tire exploded. Reporting in Hartsfield Jackson, Atlanta International Airport, Joshua Skinner, Atlanta News First. Talk about turbulence, Joshua. Thank you.